Growing up in a small town in Texas definitely informs a lot of what I do. You know, filled with resentment and anger uh, at some of the, just what I think are more like evil elements of being in a, a small town. Uh, you know, telling little kids to be afraid, otherwise they'll go to hell. Stuff like that when you're in developmental stages in your life is just, it's pretty fucked. Houston is where I lived for a while um, before Nashville, and Houston's a big city, and Houston's it's great, it's super liberal, it's the most culturally diverse city in the south. Um, I actually found the opposite when I moved to Nashville after being in Houston for so long, like Nashville's pretty, pretty southern. All of the South, you still like, no matter how progressive the city is, though, there's still like these remnants of like a forgotten, forgotten thing. Um, and maybe not so forgotten. There's just still like very old school, religious based ideologies going on. I grew up Southern Baptist. I grew up super religious, like going to church camps and you know church every Sunday and Wednesday and played music in the church and all that stuff. Being brought up like that, I still find myself having to combat things that I learned as a kid, like in a relationship or something, like ideas about guilt or jealousy. There's all of these things that I know in my mind aren't right, you know, in my rational mind, but I feel these like artifacts and remnants from the way I was brought up like creeping in sometimes and you have to combat them you know you have to really consciously try to change it like a lot of pop and R&B stuff and electronic stuff right now. There's a band actually from here called Subtract that's really cool and I like that guy Jai Paul a lot. J. Cole and Miguel and I've been really into dancing lately. So I'll, like every, every time I go out dancing I'll hear some song that I end up liking. But a child believes 